Hey, hello, 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 everyone. Hi. Hello, 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 hello. Used to be a small group today, but small and mighty. That's what matters. Yes, I'm so excited. Thank you so much, everyone, for being in this space here today. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for being here. I am so excited. I'm so excited every week, but I'm so excited this week too. <laughs> um, just to being in the space and just being able to share time with Pasafina, who's a master and incredible human being. Um, and so I cannot wait. I'm going to start by acknowledging that I am in <clears throat> I am in the traditional ancestral and unceded territory of the Gabrielino and Tobongo peoples. And as I have mentioned before, um, even the words Gabrielino and Tobongo peoples are colonized words. So it's always interesting that even acknowledging the land that we're in, colonization even follows through with this. And um, I also wanted to acknowledge that we are, the writers are still on strike and that actors are calling on a vote to see if um, they're gonna be able to strike. So a lot of things are going on right now and I'm just very grateful that folks are coming into the space and joining us and being here. So thank you so much for being in the space and being with us. I appreciate that. I wanted to acknowledge uh, Trani and Benny who will be joining us shortly as our ASL interpreters. And then um, Auden is doing our captioning. If anyone needs captioning live, we can put a little, it was in the Zoom, we can put a little link for you so that you can see the live captions as well. But thank you so much everyone for being in the space with us. And I wanna pass the baton over to the one and only Josefina Valles. Josefina! Oh, what a pleasure. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. It's like uh, coming home somehow, <laughs> twice. <laughs> um, thank you, thank you. Uh, I uh, couldn't be happier uh, to share uh, what I have done and what I do. Uh, uh, seeing what ha have been shared already, I uh, I always say that we as as a tribe we are richer because of our uh, differences and and that's what what make us so rich. What you do, uh, I needed. You know what 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 you do complements me. Uh, so I'm, I'm very much uh, uh, honored to to be here. Uh, my work as, as a playwright, uh, as a devotee, uh, mainly uh, for the arts, uh, I will share my process as, as a writer and uh, what feeds me and what maintains me. I'm very much in, uh, endeavored to uh, the wellness, the physical, the mind and the conscience of, of the creator. So I would like to to geared the the uh, the dialogue to that given the times <laughs> so then as a playwright um my is i come from the orality you know it's more the the uh, hyper quotidian hyper personal um senses i'm very much into the senses i don't start writing a theme i write and I create this bank, I become rich. I create this bank of words. I became, I, I, I'm very slow in my, in my processes. So I, I write every day. My discipline is to write and to read, read more than what I write, in fact. But uh, what I do is that I, my, my uh, general process in, in my creation, in, in writing specifically, I have at least three projects at the same time. And they have, uh, they become, uh, they are in different levels. The same, I'm very hyperactive. I get very bored very easily. So I had, since this is my profession, I, ha I have to show up. I have to produce, <laughs> I, there's no excuse. So I had to come up with, uh, with a system that will work for me. So this is what I have come up and this, that was, 30 some years ago, and it works still. So I'd have three, three, mainly three projects. Uh, at this point, right now, I have 
five projects that are coming at the same time, but they don't, they are in the different levels. So there's one that is in uh, merely research. There's another one that I'm just taking photos and audio. And they, I, I have two that are in, in the editing um, phase right now. And one that is uh, being seen by, by experts to, for, for criticisms. Yeah. So then what I do is that I, if, I, if I'm not into getting out and taking pictures or that, I, I have plenty of work to, what to do, you know? So then what I, I create every single day, few of my work, I start with a theme. Few, few of my of my projects start with the, with very concrete idea of what what it what it is or what would be. It's always by accumulation. It's what I do every single day. So it's a, a playwright life, <laughs> life and living. You know. So then it it gives me uh, centered and balanced, and it creates a rigorosity in me and my craft, me and my craft. And I'm, I'm always producing, I'm always producing, always producing and in, in every single aspect. I mean, um, very much the, taken for the research in, in, in the, for every single uh, work and every single uh, project has its own life, its own take. I, um, I recall, that I was uh, writing about silence and I wanted to experience silence in the body. And I took a whole year of uh, Japanese uh, archery. Yeah. To, cause that was of everything that I have found around in physicality, I, that was the one that was going to challenge me more. You know? And it, will, it was going to give me the alertness that I was, that I was uh, searching for in silence. So then every single uh, I, I keep my diaries of all, all my all my certainties and not so certain uh, faces of the um, project and it will take me have taken me to 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 listen to a lot of conversations that are not mine in the streets and taking a lot of photos, uh, traveling, a lot of traveling, um, but the senses the senses, the alertness of the body. So then I, for me to, uh, to survive and to strive when I started uh, working, I created a system that is called performance autology. Performance autology is for the wellness of, of the creator, physically, mentally, and me the mental, uh, I don't usually don't call the spiritual aspect, but I call conscience uh, the, that aspect. So then I'd, I, I was able to, to research different um, cultures and tea cultures, um, physicalities, uh, non-medical remedies, and still, I mean, that's, that's an ongoing. So I created a, an open system a nonlinear system that has uh, uh, work and very specific way of uh, training for alertness in the physicality. In the physicality, I, I went to mainly Asia and Russia. I uh, um, one of the uh, training that gave me uh, the best alertness in my body was the major host biomechanics. Yeah, I, I owned my my precision on stage to major holes. I, I, I and dance, danced uh, especially merengue and salsa. <laughs> uh, the the work um, uh, joy for me it's like the theme, and I can come to any any aspect of life, and I'd. I claim it as as my my political uh, uh, river, you know, the joy, the joy. I will do everything. If there's no joy, I don't want that revolution type of type of logo, you know. I um, so then I I I have been creating this this open system, and 
other people were interested in, in healing with it, from it. And the, what happens is that we have a, a basic uh, physicality and for the mental health, for uh, conscience, and each person create their own research. And each, it, it, it's an ontology, it's, it's the science of the self applied to creation. So it had been a, an amazing ride. And I, a few months ago, is that I started to complete the structure of the entire system. And it includes uh, a segment that is called vital presence, that it's for uh, aging, the aging, the illness and dying of the performer. So then the, the entire, um, is the, it will take us to to every aspect of the of life, alive, living, dying, and dead. Um, for me, I am an expert in the present, and at my present, I'm 63 and I'm getting old and I'm getting ill. So this is what I what I'm researching, and and this is I I work from there. So um, teaching it. Um, in the last, uh, as a school, my uh, Ayombe Theater, we created the school as a retreat structures. You know, I don't want to see my students every single day. You know, we are so intense. So we meet every, we were meeting for once a year for 10 days for this intensity and the creation of, of, the, of each person's the autology, not Every single ontology is different, and uh, what I what I invite is to to know the self, to know what you already have. You already have a system because we are alive, and we have a system for creation. We have a system for um, for in the ups and downs of life in every day. I I as a dancer that uh, that I that I have been. Uh, especially uh, sacred dance that I that I have done in my life, uh, we train the body to dance for for the highest, for the highest of of the invisible, for the highest of our teachers, and for the highest of every everybody uh, in 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 presence. So then, with that, before that, we have to train the body. We have, and that that goes every single day even if you perform or not, you have to train the body. So every single day, I mean, right now at 63, I have a whole different uh, learning, a whole different uh, uh, training for, for myself and, and for my peers. <laughs> and I'm still teaching what I, I, I used to train for eight, nine hours when I was uh, very young, you know? So then performance ontology have been, is the fuel for my writing. Because I mean, it, it have given me the mental um, strength uh, throughout every single aspect of of the creation and, and uh, alive. I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't take creation and and my life as as a separate uh, entity. So, you know, it is one. Uh, I'm a creator. I mean, we are creators, and um, my. Uh, my life in this world have uh, I have been touched by so many cultures, by so many teachers, by so many uh, people in the audience that I still remember, uh, like day one. You know, so that that is part of my my the the poetics of my of my life, in specifically in my playwright playwriting I. I use the po poetic forms. Uh, they already have the rhythm. And I, I'm very much into, we all much into that rhythm. Mm -hmm. And all the rhythm that, that the, po the, the poetic forms uh, bring us. But it will take us to every single culture, poetic forms. Every single culture have, have that. And that you, to, to enter, Poetic forms, you have to humble yourself because I mean you you will be touched, uh, your heart will be touched. Yeah. 
So then poetic, uh, poetic forms will make my characters or myself as, 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 as a solo performer will give me the, the rhythms that will help me um, dissect my body into many, many characters, many characters. And sometimes I'd, I'm saying one, one part of my, my face is, is one character and the other one is, is another and my hand is one and that push and pull of in writing and then in, in staging, it's what, what I'm very much interested in. Uh, why I ask what I know is the level of alertness that it gives me as a performer or as a writer. I uh, I have never wanted to understand, but I'm very much interested in feeling. Uh, very much interested in feeling. I, uh, I'm, I'm part of this world and I have a responsibility. And my my take on it is to to accompany to company. So now my my work as the, as a playwright uh, in my present as as this woman that that have uh, spent all that those years in in writing and performing is that that my writing will accompany uh, me in my uh, getting older and. Uh, Crazier. <laughs> um, the um, the writing, the uh, one of the um, what we do in performance ontology, we invite uh, people every single month of the the year for full moon. We invite you to fast, fast as an act of solidarity, as an act of training as an act of uh, alertness and the spiritual aspect of that too and the cleansing of the body that you know so that's part of our training to fast um, we need to learn um, the systems the, the, the body systems you know the um, uh, what do you do when you are going to on stage what do you do before you write during the, the writing, after the writing, we need to know, we need to know the body, the, the lymphatic system. We have to know the, the circulatory system. We, uh, from a non-medical uh, approach that, that we have, we, we go to the, to, the, to the medical experts when, when we need it and we are, when we are able to afford it, you know? but, but we have that responsibility as, as artists as performers, you know, so that I, I, all my, my, my work, it's, it's devoted to that, to how do we, uh, I have asked the elders in different communities, you know, what do we do for uh, tension when you are, uh, when we are traveling, what, do, what, what type of tea do you, do you carry it? You know, before for your performances, before the performances, all that. So that that what we have uh, is not packaged because it's always alive, it's always changing. You know, so uh, this I started in 1986 to to research uh, performance ontology, and it's just now that um that it has a structure. You know, it have been. Uh, the devotion to 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 the body. I mean, I had surgery in both knees, and I had to learn how to how to deal with it. You know, how to to work for it. You know, and 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 through that, and all that just assisted me in my research, in my research. And I'm I'm I am able to say that I'm I'm able to to give back uh, um, when I'm directing. Uh, or devising work that I'm doing that a lot now. I when we just don't do the uh, the, uh, the the work that 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 will be seen, you know, the 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 text or the performance piece. To, uh, in in the contract, we work uh, um, an essay. Um, that that the person have to create, you know, for the analysis and understanding of the processes, you know, and and to to invest in the in the in the research 
to know to know every single aspect of of the performance itself and to uh, so we have the performance the essay and they create a, a workshop of the, their own what what do you i mean i i learned in dominicanish one very specific uh, physicality but when you are creating a whole different uh, piece you you will be asked to go and research, I don't know, uh, martial arts or uh, West African dance uh, given by such and such uh, teacher, you know? So then all that will give you the, the specificity of your, of your workshop. So then uh, the, uh, and for the economic aspect, you know, because sometimes you don't have, uh, people will not hire you for your performance piece, but they will hire you to give a workshop. So then uh, to see us as in, in the many aspects that we are able to, you know, the, 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 uh, the research um, in the body that is, uh, that is holding that in that body is able to articulate it too. And for me, it's a very, very much interested in on that. Um, performance autology, we, have uh, the nation, our main nation is childhood. And so I, uh, I work a lot from with toys and games and uh, the healing of, of, of uh, where we're coming from and the celebrations are, are, are not seen as a celebration, but that as a base, you know, the, the, the nation, our nation is that, uh, that uh, is childhood. This childhood totally uh, we one of the uh, training the, the basic training uh, is to, uh, to walk we call it joy walks <laughs> but uh to walk is is, is is vital for for us as as writers and and as uh, performers uh it's, it's the meditative aspect of it what happens to the to both sides of the brain you know to study that to study that what happens to you the before, during, and after the walk-in, you know, yeah. Uh, in, in performance ontology, I organized um, the, um, the whole physical system. The base is called uh, physical prayers. So they are uh, physical prayers. Uh, I would like to share one before we go to the uh, to the question uh, Q and A. Um, one of the the uh, the physical pr prayers. I mean, I don't want to <laughs> read what, what you are able to, but it's the born alertness and by alertness of the body, and the body will will uh, give the. Um, that that centering and the the great communication between brain and heart and and I, I and I said uh, hips heart and 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 head you know but it's it's all it's all so then in alertness for alertness and by alertness uh, it will be worked in space and time uh, it has all the the physical prayers have a, a known trajectory. Uh, it's a meditative dance. It's part of our training. It's a training unit. Uh, it's, it's like the, the, the cell of our physical training and might be the, 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 um, the cell for, for the physical material of writing. Most of the time I, I, I dance to write, you know? Oh, I, I, my, my texts most of the time come from physicality you know? or the physicality that I have seen or the physicality that I, that I have uh, photographed. Um, all the physical prayers work with the, back, the alignment of the back. Uh, it will give stamina and resistance and uh, it's a communal, communal right. Is part of our training and it works as performance material for writing and for performance. 
Is a ritual of courtesy for the seen and the unseen. It's a sign of respect to all and it invoke beauty. As part of our, uh, in our retreats, part of our uh, next. Uh, this is the basic uh, or the main physical prayer. It's called tochka. And tochka is a word in, in Russian that, that is called like period, like punto, point. So tochka, uh, it might be as uh, as an honoring my, my Russian teacher. Uh, so it's hand over hand at the cent center of the chest is our uh, main physical prayer. Uh, every single hand of every person has a very particular song. It's a meditative gesture. It has the, a beginning, middle and end. And it has a, its own dance. That's tochka, that's uh, one. We do half tochka, that is just one hand at the center of the, uh, of the chest too. Next, we are today. We are going to work uh, with. It's called from peace to Eter eternity, and uh, this is one of this is I think the the um, the one that I like the most of the physical prayers. Uh, it's informed by by the peace sign that started as the non nuclear uh, the nuclear disarmament sign. In, in 1958, and it it, it was in, uh, informed that that signed by the uh, the codes that are the, um, that they use either fla flags or or lights uh, depending on arms position. Um, so imagine it it the inf it's conveyed an information to a distant point. The poetics of that, you know the poetics of that. Um, it has a, 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 an alphabet that is quite quite interesting in that, that this specific um, um, prayer. Next, so then uh, <laughs> this was one of the first uh, in 1986 that I was doing the uh, some, <laughs> some uh, drawings in that. Uh, I, now uh, we do, since 1986, we have taken the Chinese calligraphy and Chinese painting. So it, it's, it's quite different than, than that now. But I, I found that from 1986 and it was hilarious. So then uh, we become the, the peace sign. So uh, now we are going to do it for uh, sitting. Uh, and um, this is the way that it's like a one third of of the hands to the side, and you are like uh, thirty degree to to from your from your uh, trunk, the trunk of your body, and the trajectory. It's like your your arms will go all the way or uh, go all the way around to the top. You don't look at, at them, and and then you go when they meet. You go all the way down as a uh, praying uh, position, and then you go to and they land in your heart. The trajectory of, of the arms, we trained, so it will be half hour, 45 minutes. No, 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 I won't do that today. But uh, this is what, this is part of the training. We are going to, to uh, you can, when we are doing the, the trajectory, you can do, uh, you can sing, you can, uh, don't mention my mother, please, but, uh, the alignment that happens to the to the uh, to the back and what happens to the brain, we are going to experiment uh, now. Okay. So, yeah. So you will. Uh, we might might do two or three minutes, uh, and you can take what I'm sharing here for your uh, physical trainings for when you are uh, not feeling. Uh, 
in these challenging times, we need we need our body. Remember that this is the the this is the temple. This is the uh, uh, mayor hold used to call it the apparatus. Uh, <laughs> I call it the temple. Uh, and this it's it's, it's quite important the alertness of the body that will give us uh, that will lead us for uh, decisions that are better for us uh, at certain moments. Uh, hopefully now, uh, the, from peace to eternity uh, to divinity or eternity, uh, it aligns the back. But I I will not even say that. I will prefer that you that we practice it, and then you tell me what happens to you. Okay. Yeah. So, are we able to share to to do the? Uh, yes. So we become the um, the uh, the peace sign. Yes, I sit in the middle of the chair, not in the back, not in the rim. Okay. So for anyone who can turn their cameras on, this would be a great moment just to be present. Please work on this, Josefina. Yeah. So yes. Okay. So. Yeah, Peggy said a little bit, um, not in, in the back, 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 but in the middle. Yeah, there. Um, so then shoulders to the back. So you become the, the P sign and you know the trajectory. So we are going to go very slow. I mean, painfully slow. Okay. <laughs> so then uh, shoulders to the back, shoulders to the back and let's go. Let's go. Come on. Not so fast. No. Keep going. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Arms straight if you are able to. Okay. Very slow. Might go very slow. Okay. Align your back. Align your back. Feel it. Feel it. Uh, shoulders to the back. Feel it. Yeah. Keep going. Keep going. You might sing. Keep going. You might. Um, Keep going very slow, slower, Peggy. Yeah. Straighten your your the elbows. Yeah. Yes. Perfect. Keep going. Keep going up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Going. Okay. Keep going. Breathe. Peggy, uh, chin a little bit down. Yes, right there. <laughs> Keep going. Keep going till both palms will meet. But keep going slow. They will meet. You don't have to look at them. They know where they are. Keep going. Every part of the quadrant, every quadrant in that trajectory will trigger a very specific uh, feeling. And it's out. We don't keep going till both palms meet. Yes. Keep going. Align your back. Yes. This is an excellent, excellent exercise to do before you write. I say don't write. 
Keep going till both palms meet. Perfect. No rush. When they meet, all the strength that you have gathered They embraced. Both hands stop there. Yeah. When they meet, so you very, very slow, both hands together. They're going to go to Tuchka. So very slow. All the strength, all the strength. There. Painfully slow. <laughs> Margo, slower, slower. Keep going till you go to the heart. Keep going till you go to your heart. Keep going till you go to your heart. When you're in front, tochka, hand over hand, over your chest. And rest. Margot, Margot, uh, shoulders up, shoulders up and down. Again, and down, release, release, yes. Daphne, Daphne, uh, shoulders up, shoulders up, 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 yeah, and down. Okay, let's stay in Tochka. Open your eyes. Look at the hands of each person that has a uh, show. Show your 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 tochka. Show your tochka in, in your in your chest. Don't, not not just the hands in your chest. You see, each hands are we are doing the same gesture, and each person is doing it in a very particular way. This is our autology. This is our autology. Thank you. Okay. Okay. okay, undo, undo in the heart, and I'm all ears. <laughs> all ears. Yeah. Let's talk. Ready. Uh, I would love to, to hear about uh, uh, what happened now in the... In the uh, from peace to eternity or oh, divinity, I call. Yes. Questions Thank or comments? Thank you, Josefina. That was really very good. It, um, I felt like I released. It was a release. That's what it felt for me, just a, a release of a lot of, I don't know, a lot of the ener energy. It's like I was bringing in a certain kind of energy and letting out a certain kind of energy. So yeah, that felt good. Thank you. That is yours for you to take, hmm? it, it is yours, yeah, uh, use them, you, use the, these prayers. They are very, right now we need centering, we need grounding, hmm? and this is a perfect uh, perfect exercise. Uh, I'd, I organized all this stuff that I wanted to share and I said, no, that is crap. <laughs> but I, the, the, no, 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 this is all pretentious, I, I just need to, to to share what I'm feeling you might be using, you know? Yeah, thank you. Questions or comments? To use this to then be able to like sit down and write, like it makes so much, like it, it centers you. Mm -hmm. And like Margot said, it, you're releasing something and then you're also bringing some things. I can see why you would use this before you start your writing practice, like use mm -hmm. this prayer practice before you do a writing practice. Yes, totally. And people, some people will say that they have writer's block and all that. This is excellent to erase that. Uh, I mean, I don't, 
I don't go for that for that, that concept, but I mean, um, this is, is you will oh, you are always writing. You don't have a block, you know. But uh, but the body when you move the body and and in this case that is centering and is working both both sides of your um, of your hemisphere are becoming one. So this has the um, the quality of learning, yeah, of learning, of opening, of yeah. That's why it's so important. Uh, question. Um, I just wanted to comment on what you said about we're always writing because I, I really subscribe to that philosophy. I just feel like the world is my muse. And so as, as you know, thank you for saying that because I know everyone has their own methodology for how they write, but you know, I'm currently here in Southern California, but I'm about to go. And it's hard to really connect with people in Southern California because we're always in our cars. But whenever I go to New York and I spend a lot of time in New York, I always tell everyone, New York is my muse because as I walk down those streets, I hear these, you know, I may see Dominicanos, I may see Puerto Ricanos, I may see Hasidic Jews, I may see, you know, Haitians, you know, and, um, my my net my you know my son-in-law is um, Haitian, so they speak French, and you know my grandchildren are speaking in French, and so and I'm just just soaking it all in and eavesdropping on everyone's conversation, writing down how they're interacting with each other in my phone. Thank goodness for cell phones. I mean, there is some advantages to having the technology now, and so I just put it in my notes, and it's I it. It, they're my little nuggets that I draw on. Yeah, so thank you for saying that. I, yeah. Always. Always. Yeah. Uh, comments, questions about uh, the physical prayers that we did? I have a lot of trouble with um, sustaining my arms up in several, like I felt, <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I was like, I wanna quit, this is painful. <laughs> In what, what, in the quadrant, where, where was the worst? Where, where, in what, what quadrant was the worst? I think the worst quadrant for me was probably when I got here and you told me slow down and I was like, I'm trying to go faster so I don't stop. Uh, uh, do you, do you remember in your uh, arsenal of images what we have here, what we have seen? Mm -mm. I I don't know, but I right when I felt the pain. I, I, a hint, a hint. Mm -hmm. uh, he died in the cross. Ah, <laughs> well, I was going there because I said <laughs> when I got here, I said, "Damn it, I don't want to quit. I don't want to be the punk that quits. I want to keep going." But it was so much that I was like, "I give me." And when you told me sit up, I was like, "I have no support now," and I'm like this. I'm like, I don't feel. So I was thinking, I'm like, what is that about? And it's like, it's about the weight. For me, it's about the weight I carry on my shoulders, physically, ancestrally, creatively, as a mother, as an artist, as a grandmother. I have a lot of weight I carry here. That's why I ask. No, no. So please. when I went like this, I became super aware of like, I have to write all, all about that <laughs> so that I can release that. Because once I got here, I was like, thank God. <laughs> but but every, when you take it again, um, <laughs> you will notice very, uh, um, when you deep in the, in, the, uh, in the exercise, when I said deep is that you will do it, not, not mm -hmm. go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. but every quadrant will bring very specific feelings. Mm. Very specific. If you, and it's the same feelings that you had today that was your first time doing the From Peace to Eternity. And, and then it, it is worked out, you know. So it, 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 it's part of, it's, it's one of the practices that I like the most in, in, mm -hmm. in our, our group. I recall that I directed a, a piece and we trained one of the dancers that it did this, for an hour and 15 minutes. The only thing that, that that person did in the performance and the other stuff was happening, but that was the only thing that he did, you know? And I recall from day one that he, it's like, I can, I can, I can. And I said, 
That's all right. That's all right. And it, he happened to be the one that, that was chosen to, to, to do that later on. You know? But I mean, it's um, for me, my writing, um, it's in the body. You know, it's with the body, by the body. So I write from there what we have been feeling right now. You know? We have to tend the body. Uh -huh. We have to know what we the what we the intake the to eat on eat hmm? we have to know systems for that we have to learn systems and every season might be different and all that but we uh, as as uh, creators we we must know this we have to have the this is our responsibility you know the what we eat what we on eat how we on eat to hydrate to rest to continue all, all, all that that that's that's how, that's my my mantra that that I say a lot you know yeah and and this for me it's it has so much so much this exercise this prayer this physical prayer questions or comments Margo I have another question um you mentioned throughout uh about performance autology first of all how do how do you spell autology and and can you tell me is that is that an organization do you guys you mentioned retreats you I'm know gonna put it in the chat for you so that you can also take a look at it later so you have um, mm -hmm. access to that. performance autology was the um uh is the practice that i created okay the practice that i created and i started is the research that i since 1986 that i have been doing and is for the wellness of the physical, mental, and conscience of the creator. Okay. And, um, this is very specific training. And we did, um, I, we have this beautiful history, uh, how the school was created in the, the first retreat was done in New Zealand. And there were retreats in India, in Chile, Dominican Republic, um, United States, India. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So then it's 10 days that we that we have this intense uh, intense meeting for for the uh, uh, right now uh, we are doing one to one because uh, I mean it is easier for people to to schedule that so I'm doing just one to one uh, till two more years because I mean now people are creating and creating their own their own uh, their own autology and they are uh, teaching performance autology my students already <laughs> oh okay yeah. yes and they are much much better than me oh. <laughs> yes yes <laughs> but, uh, yeah, yeah yeah it's like it, it's my ass. <laughs> yeah. so, questions and comments yeah yeah the uh, the the importance is the alertness of the body to be alive, living, you know, and that that it, we have system. What do we? What do you do? I one of the uh, uh, work that we do is uh, castor oil packs. Castor oil packs, hmm? and that is excellent for the nervous system. You know, we have a lot of people with depression. We have a lot of uh, uh, people with anxiety in our in our work in our uh, tribe. You know? So then we need to have a um, hold of, of our non-medical uh, techniques and practices from you know, our elders. And that is one. Okay. Comments, uh, questions? So practitioners who study uh, performance autology, so they spend like 10 days, um, and then in those 10 days, are they learning about performance ontology or when they're working with you one on one and then they're working on their own performance? How do they sort of blend the two, like learning about performance ontology and then incorporating into their own performance? Yeah, they I will um, share with with the, with the group later, later on uh, people that have done the work with me for a while. I. Um, in the uh, during the retreat, you embodied the training. You know, mm -hmm. so uh, we are very uh, um, 
invested in silence. So we keep silence till, till breakfast. Uh, we start working at four o'clock in the morning. We meditate, we train, physically train. Um, uh, we have wonderful, uh, we're treated a, uh, uh, it's a, it's a window that is, is quite uh, a lot to learn, you know, uh, and I'm still learning. I, in the research of the, um, the research and creation of performance ontology, I learned that uh, uh, women, we have different levels of a balance every single day. So then as a director and as a performer, I have to have that in my mind. Yeah? So then I, I'm not able to ask my, my, my dancer or my, my actor to fly it when I know that. So I have to create a system that, that they feel secure, that they feel secure physically on stage, knowing that, that information. So then a lot of things have happened to me that, that, that I, uh, my, my way of directing, you know, my way of, of uh, relating to, to, to the artists is, is have to be different, you know, have to be different because of one little morsel of, of knowledge that I have, have learned. What does autology mean? I mean, I know I can look it up. I, I... No, 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 please uh, ask. <laughs> You're here. Autology is a science of self. And uh, this, this word uh, was uh, used like three times before I used it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so performance autology, when I use performance, it's not the genre of performing, just, just the genre. It's about performance, the la life. Uh, performance uh, the action the it, it it like all the layers of the of the word all the uh, the uh, the the meanings the, the possible meanings including the 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 action of life yeah. that's interesting yeah Which then affects us as it all it affects us as artists in so mm -hmm. many ways we are that yeah mm -hmm. i mean our our everyday existence is a performance Entering certain spaces is a performance. Speaking to certain people is a performance. And I have a question in, in that realm, like when we are with ourselves, would that be considered a performance or is it when we are with ourselves that are that we are? Yes, we are performing. We are more than performances. We are embodying our ontology. It's the science of ourselves. Uh, regardless of uh, with or without audience, mm -hmm. <laughs> it is is the self what is the the prime uh, uh, motive is is taking care of the doer, you know. It, it we are. I'm not calling myself uh, much of a performer, but a celebrant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That that uh, uh, the doer, the doer, the action. But uh, uh, it's taking care of taking care of uh, of. Us. It is not. It's not fun anymore to uh, to be the the artist that, that trash his or herself. No, uh, right now um, we want. Uh, I, I want my. I want my tribe. I want. I, I want us to succeed. I want us well. I want us well. And too many artists right now are not well. Yeah. Yeah. Right now it is a very challenging times and. Uh, um uh, we need to be responsible um uh, for for the self and for for the others uh at least a company sometimes uh knowing if you take care of yourself uh, you are already doing great for for our community yeah? this is what what we need we need ourselves to do uh take care of ourselves and and the people around um the, we i have I don't have much to share or teach in terms of uh, creation, uh, artistically creation, because I really, uh, I'm waiting for people to create, you know? I, 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 and I, I'm interested in what people are, that have already. I, I'm able to, to guide that. I'm able to, to, to invite or come on, come on, give me that, you know? But I, uh, I, I, as I own the theater is, is taking care of ourselves. 
uh, to for us to be uh, sovereign, not for for me to be taking care of you. As so uh, no, no, no. Go, go, go. Come up, come up, come up. You can do it. Come on, I'm here. Come on, just in case I'm here. But I mean, let's let's do it. Let's do it. Uh, we need we need uh, uh, sanity in this time because I mean we need to to do uh, better uh, decisions. And already the, the our market it is quite uh, a lot of uh, negations and the, the, a lot of no's. We deal with a lot of no's, you know, in 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 our in our work. Uh, so we need to have that that uh, uh, the body and the mind to to continue. You know? How do we do that? How do we do that? We have to take care of it. And there's a lot of, in all the, the indigenous uh, cultures, we have a lot of uh, uh, training for that, for taking care of, you know? So this is what I, what I, I did and I'm still doing, you know, looking for that, for that information and, and, and applying it. Uh, it takes a long time. It, it does, it does, because you have to travel and you have to listen and, and, um, and try it and then, I'm not teaching what I was taught. I am teaching what what gave me uh, I had a result. Because mm. I mean, what I, I I was taught a lot of stuff, and uh, I I I was hurt physically. Yeah. <laughs> so I, I'm not teaching that. So I'm teaching what what gave me results. So so there was a lot of uh, uh, you have to go back to the trainings and say this this stay why stays you know. And, and each person will have their own set of, of the physicalities and, and creation and will explore all the stuff and will come back and share it. So we are so rich. We are so rich. Aww. Questions or comments? Thank you, Josefina. We have probably time for one more comment or one more question. What happens when you have pets? They jump on your stuff. One more comment or one more question from anyone? When's your next retreat? The next retreat, uh, we are waiting for. We are waiting for uh, to check what is happening uh, uh, overseas and stuff uh, in 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 the madness in the world. Because I mean, it have to be very secure for for me to do that. So I am waiting. Uh, from my guys, the yes. <laughs> so that 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 I don't decide that I don't decide that. But I mean, I um, there's a lot of information there. I I sometimes I, I'm doing the um, workshops uh, and um, we meet. We on Sundays we do bordamo, that it, we we um, do embroidering and it's the amo type, and we we do a lot of a lot of little things. No, uh, but uh, I own the theater. Uh, thank you, thank you. I mean, I really wanted to share uh, autology as part of our our quest for our writing. Uh, that what accompanies our writing for the wellness, uh, for our the the, the well being of of the creator. And the importance uh, of that. The, the yeah the the, the vital the, the uh, you can go to my my website and there's information about vital vital presence and the work that I'm doing now uh, the last now is the last five years is called <laughs> testimony <laughs> it's just, it's just, I'm slow the testimony uh, testamentos y testimonios testimonies and testaments uh, oh, today chat right now well Josefina thank you again so much. Um, Thank you, thank you, thank you. I also wanted to thank uh, Trani and Benny for being our ASL interpreters today. And mm -hmm. also thank our captioner and everyone that's in the space. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. We'll be back <laughs> thank you. Same thank time, you. same place, y'all. So please join us, join us, join us, join us. Um, come into the space. And again, thank you, everyone. Thank you so much. And bye, everyone. Bye, 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 bye. Have a beautiful Vodka. day. Vodka for you. <laughs> Thank you. Gracias, Josefina. Muchas gracias. Oh, un placer siempre. Bye. bye. Gracias. Gracias. Chao. Bye.